So here I am, we're at Liam Oren, and we're driving down to the Lofty House at Clonmel for the award ceremony of International Film Festival Ireland, and we're going down for the champagne, but uh, we'll see what happens. What do you think, Liam? I think we have a good chance here of picking up an award. So, uh, with a little bit of luck, we'll be coming home with something. Great. If not an award, maybe a woman. Either way, I'll be happy. What do you think? I mean, I, I go for the award. You can get the woman. <laughs> I'm happy with that. Okay, Liam, so we're down here at Knock Lofty House, the base for uh, the International Film Festival Ireland in Clamell. What do you think of the surroundings? This, this is a unique place. It's the home of the Healy Hutchins and Erla Dunnock Moore, who were kidnapped by the IRA in the 80s, I think. It's a very prestigious place. It's magnificent. It's parkland designed probably by Capability Brown. Hi, I'm Mark Terry. I'm with Polar Cap Productions from Toronto, Canada, and I'm here at the International Film Festival in Ireland with my new film, The Antarctica Challenge, A Global Warning. Everyone says that. Everyone feels that way about their own government. I'm Erin Gavigan, and I'm here with the Willing Suspension of Disbelief. I, I play a, sort of a, a character that has a dual role in a classic war type film. I'm the, the dutiful woman and also the femme fatale. So. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> the one. We know by the red hair, I can tell you that. Distinguished guests. Ladies and gentlemen, friends in film, you're all very, very welcome to this very special occasion tonight. It wraps up for us what's been the most incredible week of film, fun, and a few frolics, if I may use that expression. <laughs> We've had an absolute ball. The house is crammed packed full of filmmakers from 34 countries around the world, meeting with these people, seeing their work. And just spending time with them has been an absolutely awesome experience. Wow. Uh, thank you very much. And the winner is 8.5 hours. <laughs> Organizers of the International Film Festival in Tipperary, especially Will Nugent. Uh, this film uh, was hard to make, it was enjoyable to make, but it was hard to make, and it has survived largely because of small festivals like this. And what really um, boosts us at this festival is the reactions of the audience and awards like this. And with a great week here in Tipperary, with a great reaction to our screenings, and uh, it thanks very much. It was uh, we're uh, very grateful. And we had to work with Liam Moran, who, I mean, perhaps I had a vision for the film, but Liam Moran was a man who was a bit more practical than I am, and he made the logistics and the film possible. So uh, he deserves as much as I do. So, where you go, Liam? I, I, I would be a man of few words. I wouldn't have the artistic talent that Brian has, but sometimes you do have to push the director. And we're very pleased to come down here to Tipperary to win this award. God bless you all! Hi, I'm Rupa Ayer, I'm from India. Um, uh, my film was nominated here, it's called The Cover Page, it's about a small girl having HIV AIDS. Um, today I won the award for the um, feature film category. Thank you very much.
And who are you? Cassie Cusper. And tell me about your film. It's about people with gaps between their two front teeth. Some people love their gaps, some people hate it. And those who love it really love it, those who hate it hate it. But in Africa, you get a huge dowry if you have a gap. So I said, if you have a gap, keep it and love it. Gap pride, baby. Gap pride. And you won an award tonight. What, what category was that? Uh, documentary. Wow. Documentary. It's a honey, it's a beehive. And it's made from you. And I heard it's the same size as an Oscar, so. It's a local man. Thanks for looking up. It's the same size as an Oscar. Thanks for looking up. Yes, yes, yes. At the last night of the festival, how did it go? I think it was absolutely amazing. The whole week has been fantastic, but as a, an event to wind up the week, I think it was a true success. I'm delighted that so many people came over and made it possible. <laughs> Okay, so we're just coming back from uh, International Film Festival Ireland. I quite enjoyed the trip. What did you think of it, Liam? I thought it was uh, an exceptional small festival. You'd have to give them all credit, the rent prize. And the biggest the striking thing was how international it was. You had people from Bangalore, you had people from Hong Kong, you had people from Vancouver, Canada, um, South Africa, all over the place. It was amazing how many people, and a lot of, a lot of just ordinary USA people. And um, it, they had a good quality of films there, and the one thing was best thing for ourselves was, was to come home with the award. 